So this morning we were walking Wink and getting such a kick out of her being Wink. She was trucking down the sidewalk, sniffing everything she could get her little nose on, just trotting with such attitude. And it was such a different wink that then we knew just a few short weeks ago. And I, I really like this thought um, came over me and I, I knew I was going to share this because I think somebody needs to hear this. And, and here was it basically. This dog is unfolding before us day by day and we're starting to see who she really is. And she's starting to figure out who she really is because she didn't really know because she was very limited in her experience. She was living in a cage. She was living in fear. And she had been removed from the very nature of who she really is. And it seemed so parallel to what happens to us when we put ourselves in a cage and when we live in fear, we forget who we really are or we don't ever really get to know who we are because the chemicals of fear shut down so many parts of us, literally. Like our digestive system shuts down, our breathing changes, our, uh, uh, our focus becomes so narrow because everything is about survival. And you parallel that to what's happening in the world today and how our focus is narrow how we are somewhat caged, how some of us are living in fear. Uh, and it may not be a new experience for some. Some of us, and I've lived years and years in this state, have felt fear and anxiety for long periods of time. And we forget who we really are. Our creative center shuts down. Our ability to access joy and to relax and to be spontaneous and to be loving and to be empathetic are hijacked. We're hijacked. And I remember a dog that came to live with us not long ago who was hijacked with fear, who didn't know about walks in nature, who didn't know the joys of sniffing. But once the fear was removed, she blossomed to become who she really is. So that is so relevant to the work that I do and the process of unfolding that I see so often with energy work and EFT tapping. And I wanted to share that and also remind you of something that I have reminded you of before is that I offer a free session to get you comfortable with EFT tapping personally. So if any of this resonates with you and you haven't taken advantage of my offer, please do. This is a reminder, okay? So have a beautiful day, everyone, and we'll see you soon.